Most people don't feel like it. At 5 a.m. when my alarm goes off, I don't feel like it either. But you know what? I get up. Because I'm a man. Because I'm a leader. Because I set the freaking example. Because I'm going to win. And I see some of you guys, you lost that chip on your shoulder. You know what? I'm fucking pissed off sometimes because you don't have the life that you want right now and you should have it. Who else is pissed off for you? Some of you have that I've arrived look on your face. I didn't feel like it. I don't give a fuck what you felt like doing. Guys, is it time for you to call the shots in your own life, yes or no? If you're gonna win, you're gonna have to do shit you don't wanna do. Am I right? That's everybody's problem. Everybody's freaking crowd pleasers. They're ass kissers. Dude, you guys could all be great, but you don't feel like it. I wanna tell you what cowards do. They pull themselves out of the fire too early. Gold and silver is refined in fire and it burns the blemishes off it to make it perfect. But if you pull the gold and silver out of the fire too early, it ruins it. And some of you, the reason why we can't help you grow and get to new levels is because you keep going to alcohol, to drinking, to drugs, to f toxic people. I need you to think, who f***ing told you you weren't going to make it? Come on, who told you? Can you think of their name right now, yes or no? Can you guys think of somebody right now that told you you weren't going to make it? Okay, I remember when I started my business with my wife, I remember us telling some people that we thought loved us and cared about us what we were going to do. And you know what they fucking did? They told us that we're fucking stupid and there's not a chance in hell this is going to happen. And I said, you fucking watch. And you know what they said? Hey man, I'm just joking, dude. I don't like that fucking joke. That isn't very funny to me. I don't like that shit because I don't like where I'm at. And that's a joke to you. And if a joke is funny, it's funny between two people. And I don't find it fucking funny. So I write their fucking name down. I wrote down what they said in quotes. And that motherfucker, I think about him. And when I feel like quitting, and I don't feel like waking up, and I got a problem, I just reach into this little baggie, and I pull out what that motherfucker says, and now I'm back awake. You guys get it? Would you guys stay in a relationship with somebody that constantly lied to you? That's why you guys don't listen to yourself anymore. That's why you guys don't respect yourself anymore. You do what you do because of what you think about yourself. When you break promises, you guys say, I'm gonna get up five o'clock and go to the gym. You hit that snooze button, you're hitting the snooze button on God, on your wife, and on your kids, on your business, and on yourself. You're gonna start talking differently. You're gonna start acting differently. You're gonna go through a season of saying no to bullshit distractions and shit that makes you unfocused. If it isn't good for you and it doesn't make you the most elite and the greatest, the alpha leader, and it doesn't take you to your new life, the answer is f off. Stop saying you want to be successful when you don't. Stop listening to the motivational videos on fucking YouTube and getting fired up when you won't fucking change. What do we need to do? Somebody tell me what we need to do. What do we need to do to change you? We need to get you fucking bankrupt and have you lose everything. We need to make you homeless. What do we need to do? How much pain do you need to fucking change? How can I be just like you? Dude, how can I get those results? Dude, how do you have so much energy? I say, dude, how could you not have this much energy? There's people today in the hospital that are breathing their last breath and I'm healthy. I'm not disrespecting God anymore. Okay, I got one life. Everybody, make it count. Do you need to be reminded again? Write this down. Don't wait for something bad to happen before you give your best and change. Until you guys hit rock fucking bottom and you lose everything, most of you won't fucking change. And it's sad. Okay? The low people, you know what they do? They complain, they bitch, they cry, they whine. They're always fucking wrapped up in bullshit. They're always fucking broke. The top people just keep fucking climbing. It's a separator. You want to conquer and divide? You guys need to decide today what you're going to do.